All right, guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to install EDFX since a couple of people are having issues trying to figure out how to do it. So, um, so what you need to do is you need to go to Twitter and type in for Skypat, and you'll come to his page, and he's the guy who made uh, EDFX. Come right here to his pinned tweet up at the top, and you'll see uh, right now we're at 2.1. So imagine if he gets to 2.2, it'll be another pinned tweet, but you click on this link. It takes you right to the Dropbox. Click Download save this I'm saving it into my downloads folder I'm gonna open the folder and you're gonna extract a folder or extract the zip file I'm just gonna put it in the same spot for right now and yeah now you'll see that we have a EDFX folder I'm gonna go ahead and cut this folder and I'm gonna put it in the same location that I have Elite Dangerous installed just to keep them in the same spot so for me, it's um, most people may have it on their C drive, but I have it on another, on another drive. But the, the directory, the path will still be about the same. So program files, frontier, and I'm not going to put it in some IDE launch. I'm just going to put it right here at the root. So we'll go in that folder, and depending if you have 32-bit or 64-bit, depends on which executable you're going to run. So I'm going to run this on 64-bit. Double-click and well, let me move some stuff over here. FX system files are not installed. Do you want to install it now? Just go ahead and say yes. And it's going to basically tell you that you need to go and down, download the reshade uh, framework. And it'll give, take you right to the link as soon as you click OK. Take you right there. Now you don't need this. What you need to do is scroll down and get the reshade framework. Click download here. Now I'm going to go ahead and tell you this is going to take you to uh, MediaShare, which I do not like MediaShare at all. I think it's a dangerous site to get viruses and stuff from because if you do not pay attention to what you click and the pop ups that come along with it, um, yeah, it can be pretty bad. So take that. Just follow what I do. Don't click on anything else. Click download. Yeah, it says um, now that this is basically telling you all right, what we did earlier, you know, download the files and it tells you put the downloaded. 7-zip file into your documents wherever you have um, so let me documents EFX updates folder or unzip it so I'm just going to take the file that I just downloaded which was uh, the frame, what, let me get back to this framework file so we're going to cut this and put it into documents updates folder <coughs> EDFX so documents EDFX updates folder paste it in there. EDFX will use it automatically, if not just restart EDFX. So we'll click OK. We don't need this because it's trying to pop that back up. Reshade has been found. Do you want to update EDFX? Sure. EDFX has been updated with Reshade. So now we're good there. Now we need to tell it. Alright, so it already knows where my Elite Dangerous was. I think this is because I had it installed before, but you may need to tell it exactly where you have Elite Dangerous uh, executable installed at. So just make sure that um, for me, you know, it was um, it's going to be your program files, uh, Frontier, ED Launch, Products, and right here. So. But yeah, uh, it says FX not installed. So let's just relaunch EDFX. And now it says uh, it is installed, it's green. And select the profile you want to use. And I'm just going to use the, the full effects. All right, now that we're, I'm logged into Elite right here, I'm just going to keep reshade up. And I want to have it on the settings I want to use. I don't use a uh, FOV blur because it looks pretty nasty. I'm going to hit launch or Elite Dangerous and you'll see that whenever this uh, as long as this is up and running EDFX you'll see that it will um, generate some stuff up in the top left corner and there it goes and I'll tell you if it successfully um, installed it there you go succeeded and you can see it's um, running right now it looks different if I wanted to go ahead and click on split screen to do a comparison it'll run this again So there, you can see that this is working, and um, yeah, so that's EDFX, that's how you install it.